And NBC's Bill Neely is back, joins us with the latest on Secretary of State Tillerson's meeting with Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov. Bill. Yeah, good morning, Michelle. We think that meeting is still going on. It's about two hours now since they began. It started late, and it started with what sounded very much like a dressing down of Rex Tillerson by Sergei Lavrov, the Russian foreign minister. He said, we've heard a lot of ambiguous and contradictory ideas from Washington. We've seen troubling actions in Syria, meaning the airstrikes. It's fundamentally important. These actions don't happen again in the future. He also said it's important for us to understand the real interests of the United States. In other words, Sergei Lavrov uh, looking for clarity from America. Is it Assad must go or not? Rex Tillerson gave a much shorter reply. I think we can hear a few of Rex Tillerson's words now. Let's take a listen. Our meetings today come at an important moment in the relationship so that we can further clarify areas of common objectives, areas of common interest, even when our tactical approaches may be different. Even when our tactical approaches might be different, that word is important because I think he's not going in there with an ultimatum or a demand to the Russians, give up your support for uh, Syria's President Assad. But I think he'll say tactically, OK, we understand uh, your position in the Middle East, you're allied to Iran and Assad and Hezbollah. But strategically in the world, is that the wisest place for you to be? Does that get you anywhere? with the Sunni Arab world. So uh, again, I think Rex Tillerson will, will not go in with an ultimatum. As I say, the talks have been going on for a couple of hours now, uh, and they're then going to have uh, a working lunch. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.